Oh, we are back. Okay, this is crazy. I'm sat in the exact spot that I was when I filmed my LA vlog in December, which is just so surreal. So much has changed since then. It's absolutely mental, like with regards to like influencing and like just all that kind of stuff. It's just been mental. But yeah, welcome to part one of the LA vlog. I'm hoping I can do this in two parts um, and get enough beforehand before the wedding. But I feel like time is like, I don't know, kind of moving fast, but it's like, I'm just hoping I can capture some bits before that weren't enough to make a video for this. And then we'll go honeymoon Hawaii and then back to LA. So we're coming back to LA later on in the month. So welcome to the LA vlog part one. Let me adjust. So this is the pre-wedding time. So it's been a bit of a weird one. This is day two for us. We landed on Saturday and then only had like the afternoon and just like tried to stay awake. That was the day that we were, was challenging, I would say. Had our flight. I'm clearly still very tired right now. And then that evening we went out and we had like so much food. So we had like chips, nachos with guacamole. We had cheesecakes because they had the pumpkin cheesecake is out. So obviously I went and had the pumpkin cheesecake. We had drinks to try and stay awake. It was just chaos. And obviously the next day I did not feel bueno. It's rare that that stuff ever enters my body. So it was a little bit tricky the next day, but it's okay. Um, and I felt like dehydrated from the flight and like puffy and all that stuff. But yesterday we, but it was fun. We went and did like our big walk down to Melrose. I went to Creation. I'll show you guys some clips here, but I went to Creation. Then we went to the Melrose Market, which is like my favorite thing to do, but it was so hot. I don't, I've never seen it on my Apple weather, 41 degrees. It was insane, like you step outside and it's literally like a sauna. But yeah, so that was mental. And then we went to the Grove, hung out. What else did I get? I think because it was so hot, we like hardly ate anything and just kept drinking loads of stuff. So I went to Air One. I had like a poppy and a barcode and it was just, and then we went to like Alfred's in the morning. I had a Chaga Chino, which is like my favorite coffee ever. Um, I think Chaga is like a mushroom. I don't know. I seem to really love like mushroom drinks. Like Nachoya do this like nighttime blend that's all made of mushrooms and it is literally my favorite thing. But yeah, so rushing out now, we're gonna go to Beverly Hills. We're gonna do like our big walk up Sunset, which is like on the way to like the Beverly Hills Hotel. Then we turn down and go to like Rodeo. And they've just opened Air One in Beverly Hills. So you know I'm gonna hit that up. And yeah, I feel back on track this morning. I woke up, it's only two days without doing a workout, which is what I normally do on the weekends. I normally do Saturday, Sunday, tend to be no workout. Sometimes Sunday I will do a little workout in the morning. But yeah, woke up, did eight minute abs, then I did a half hour, half hour full body as well. Join form, obviously. And yeah, I just felt like back to myself a little bit, showered, got ready. My hair goes so curly here. I don't know if it's like the wattage in America. <laughs> My curlers are extremely, extremely, strong um but yeah so we're jetting out now i'm gonna go to beverly hills i'm gonna go to sun life organics this morning and get myself my favorite smoothie bowl but i think i might mix it up and get one with cashew butter but i'll show you guys anyway i woke up at 4 30 this morning so if i look a little sleepy you know why Today everyone's arriving from London, so it's gonna be like June's coming, Molly. Molly's already here with her boyfriend, but we haven't met up with them or anything. And then Becca's coming with June. Um, Cav's parents are coming with his brother. And yeah, so today it's gonna be, I think this evening they're gonna be really tired, so we might just go and grab some food. Um, and I really wanna go to Sweet Greens today, so. Mm, this is my kind of day. Lots of walking, smoothie bowls, and salads. Ignore the fact that I have my bag on because we are now gonna go. But yeah, my eyes are so gungy. Okay, yeah, so two part series, this is the pre-wedding time. So I'm hoping I can capture more content and maybe just like some of the stuff that we do with everyone before. But tomorrow we're gonna have like a big day with just um, us girls. We're gonna go to like Beverly Hills again. So I'm just gonna give them like a tour, take them to Hollywood Boulevard, do all the stuff, the touristy sort of stuff. I feel like I'm slurring my words, I'm so tired. And then we jet off to Hawaii after the wedding on Wednesday. It's so weird though, I feel so detached from the wedding. I feel like it's not actually happening, which is quite a worry, but I'm sure it's all gonna fall into place and gonna be absolutely fine. So yeah. Okay, we're gonna go now. I will see you guys at Sun Life. I got the Bliss Bowl and then I just got an alum in water. I'm excited. Went to rush and get a 
marriage license. Tomorrow is the wedding. Wow! Officially out. I do. It's the best of my life. <laughs> this outfit on I feel like I'm going to a business meeting Junior in it love that love that Jay and Rodeo. Turns out Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Welcome to the Grove Trolley. My name is Stagger Lee. I will be your conductor for this ride. Over in the front, we have Carlos. He's going to be our driver. Let's go, Love it. Wow. One minute ride. 1920 in Los Angeles. It is fully electric. It runs on 612 volt batteries. Love it. Eco friendly. Look at right in your nose. <laughs> Maybe something to drink you can pop into Edo guys. <laughs> gonna be my last moment alone my face has puffed so much from drinking two glasses of wine last night like how does this happen i just ate a pumpkin yogurt because what else do i do i couldn't believe it found it in trader joe's literally tasted like heaven this is very very surreal very weird me and cab i feel like we're so calm in ourselves but i feel like everything around it is just like a little stressy but i'm like i'm sure it's gonna be fine i think i feel like i'm too chill I'm a little too, I feel like I'm numb. Like I'm so chill that it's alarming. So yeah, this is probably the last moment I'll have alone for the rest of the day. And the last time I will be a single prank. Also my fake tan. Oh well. It's so weird being off stories though. I find it really hard to not be on Instagram. Um, like I really want to post this morning and I'm just like, should I? But yeah. So now I'm gonna chill and this is the last you'll see me before I get married. This is very odd. Well, peace and love. And I will see you guys now probably in, either I'll include some footage in this from the wedding or next time I see you, it'll be the Beverly Hills Hotel. Whoa, the hill. slices literally the size of my head and it was so good but obviously we couldn't take it because obviously we're flying but god my voice is so deep oh that's better but yeah we couldn't take any of the cake so <clears throat> that's why i wolfed three huge pieces of the size of my head genuinely okay i'm gonna go and explore the beverly hills hotel because this is crazy Steal you. <laughs> How has it just started raining the day after our wedding? 